Good morning, Ospreys. Today is Thursday, November 18th, 2021. The weather today will be sunny and cool. Today's lunch choice is... Roasted turkey. Today's specials day is... A1. Now to Dr. Sherrod's for morning meeting. Good morning, everybody. Happy Thursday. Today's Thursday. That means it's Thoughtful Thursday. So we get to hear from Mr. Haley and Miss Lindsay. So enjoy this insightful Thoughtful Thursday video. Hello, everybody. Welcome to another Thoughtful Thursday. Here we are once again back on our Thoughtful Thursday. I kind of like doing these. I do too. You know, We've talked a lot about bucket fillers. We do, and they remember it every week. What's a bucket filler? Bucket filling is when you do something nice for someone or you compliment them. Uh, it fills your bucket and their bucket. Ooh, I want to stop on that word you used, nice. Right. Right. Let's talk about nice for a minute. Let's also talk about respect. When is respect, give me some examples of respect respect so respecting what others say or their property being nice to their property making sure you're keeping the tables clean in the classroom taking care of things so you kind of got respect for yourself mm -hmm. respect for others mm -hmm. and respect for our environment yep could you say our environment includes our school it does hmm got another question for you okay i'm leading you down a path our custodians our what? Our custodians. You know, our custodians are amazing. They are. They work really hard. Really hard. They're always nice to me. Mm -hmm. And I think they're pretty, pretty much always nice to everyone. Mm -hmm. Would you agree? I agree. So, hmm, let me ask you this question. If I go into, let's just say a, a restroom. Okay. And I write all over the wall. Who cleans that off? Well, our custodians do. Our custodians. Mm -hmm. Wait a minute. So I just said I like our custodians mm -hmm. and now I'm creating extra work for them. What did I just do to their bucket? Just emptied their bucket. I did just empty their bucket. You know, when there's people that we really like and that treat us nicely, doesn't it kind of seem like we should treat them nicely too? I agree. By not, if we disrespect their property and disrespect them by drawing all over the walls, then we're creating more work for them and that doesn't make them happy. It doesn't really show that we care about them, does it? Nope. It kind of says the opposite. It does. Yet we say that they're great and we really like them, which we truly do. Mm -hmm and then we create more work for them. Yep. So when you're out there and you're doing things, even when you're not being watched, try to think about how it impacts others, how it fills their buckets and how it shows respect. Yep, because you wouldn't like it if someone took your property or your desk and colored all over it and then you had to clean it up. I, I like that version. If you wouldn't like it, Probably not a good choice to do it for someone else. Nope. With something to think about. On Thoughtful Thursday. Y'all have a great day. And now for our JPS mission statement. JPS kids soar higher. Super problem solvers. Outstanding writers. Accomplished readers. Ready for success. And now for a success equation. Hard work plus resiliency plus teamwork equals success. What goes up and never goes down? I don't know. Your age. <laughs> Have a great day, y'all.